Hello everybody and welcome back to FTL Advanced Edition. We're clicking new game, random, but we're playing the Kestrel. Alright, let's go with the Kestrel. Kestrel is a pretty, actually, it's a really decent ship, all things considered. Doesn't have any specialty, it starts as a gunship with only humans. Uh, attack the pirate. Continue. One Artemis there, and then keep the burst laser going. And we should be good on this fight. And clicky. I missed that. Alright, so let's start up with a Kestrel run. Enemy FTL is charging. Hmm. Should have gone with the shields, apparently, with the, with the laser. I didn't realize he, had, he only had two power. If he gets the piloting fixed, then we'll fire the missile. Aw, really? We're gonna... <sighs> That's unfortunate. If I had gone for the shield, I would have pulled off in the... Uh, both he, both guys. Pledge to what you can. Press marker on my map. Oh yeah, you gotta get, go get healed. Did you, Liam gets healed. All right, go home, Liam. Dude. Oh, quest marker's right there. Let's do what we can. Bombard their structures. Hmm. Nearby patrol ship. One missile for them. And we do need to be more cautious about our missile usage. But he has two bars to go at the same time. Not good. Send somebody over there. Next one will go on the lasers. Uh, that's not good. Okay. His weapons are offline, so we can take time to fix our stuff now. Go home. Make the weapons work faster and give us more evasion. If those weapons are out of sync, then that's good for us. So, we'll just let it go with that. Go after the piloting. Where are my sensors? Oh, sensors are way up front in the cash drop. I forgot about that. <coughs> Which means it's not really easy to pull somebody real quick to go take a peek at their systems. But they're dead now. So it doesn't really matter. Good enough. Distress beacon. Sure. Let's go to the distress beacon and see what we can do to help. We'll give them fuel. And they update our map. So there's a store there. Exits here. Nebula. I think we can go here, there, 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 there. To oh, this one can jump straight to there. Two, three, four. I think I want to cut that a little less close. That's a beam drone, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Beam drone. We want to take that drone out. That's why. It's the only thing that can do damage to us, so... We'll let him whale away at our shields. Whale? Really? Whale's the time you're gonna... Alright. Mm. Wow, we shoot him full of holes. And that'll work for us. This way it gives us a chance to upgrade our evasion. Which may not be doing anything. Or we may not get any evasion upgrades. Because he just hasn't missed yet. 
now he's dead. So, no evasion, though we did give him the chance. To the store. Can't get the. Unless I sell the bracelets, I can't get the drone control, which would be good. Could sell the missile and get hacking. No. Nope, we'll just not take anything here. Waste of a jump. So, that's unfortunate. I was hoping for a flat cannon, honestly. Enemy FTL is charging. Take out their weapons. One missile on their piloting. And, let's see if we can't keep this guy busy. Next, fire on their shields. Since they don't have the weapons, come take a peek real quick. Okay, we have two guys fixing the piloting. If the burst laser can hit all three of these, then he's dead. Good miss on that shot. Not that it would have done any damage to us because of the shields. But, that's great. He has an ion and a drone. I think we want to let the ion through. Yeah. Now we can let that happen. Because we took one point of damage there. Which we only would have taken anyway because we broke the drone. Rubble, But. Um, we broke the drone. But if we had missed with that and not broke the drone, then we would, would have still had another chance to do the second volley. Let's go after the piloting. That way we can have that. His evasion knocked out. Okay, no more evasion for you. Doesn't matter where we shoot you next. As long as we hit, you're dead. And that's how this fight goes. There's a lot of this with the uh, Kestrel. <coughs> the watching and waiting and making sure that everything is going how it's supposed to. I can do this jump, and then I can probably do the next little jump jump as long as we're still in the nebula. As long as it doesn't cheat going across my front, my bow, it'll only stagger one shield. Take out that drone so it can stop doing damage to us. You're not going to get that done. So we just have to we rely on weapons to get to prevent more damage. That's not good. You go fix the oxygen. Okay, he's dead. Now we start fixing things. No fire. Okay. You get healed. You two fix this. Turn the oxygen back up. Go fix the piloting. 
you are evasion. So back to engines with you. Everybody go home, close the doors. Good enough on oxygen. Med bay off, missile on, and jump to... Ion storm? No. We're gonna skip the ion storm because I don't have any way of really dealing with it right now. Next sector. Well, let's go bottom path. Right? Yeah, I guess. Bottom path it is. Save those nebulas for later rather than hitting it right up front. Check out the store. Should we grab hacking already? Sure. We'll grab hacking. Hail them. Okay. Hack their piloting. On their weapons. No more evasion for you. At least not yet. One drone and this guy's dead. Who? That's a lot of repair. NGs. Annoying. Oh well, we'll keep punching their weapons. And they won't be able to hurt us. Yeah, I'm just not gonna let, let up on the, actually, yeah, that's fine. Just don't let up on the weapons. Keep punching it. They'll, eventually they'll die. One will take any damage from it. Mm. Apparently we killed their NG. That's pretty cool. Last volley. And dead. Contact the refugee ship. Good enough. Ship. Give me another power bar. Turn the that back on. Okay, we do need to think about our defenses. This is one of the cool things about the ship with only three people. Is I can just do that number. They'll come to me. And now we just punch them to death. <laughs> Alright, everybody go home. Do 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 jump. Let's do all of this little nebula here because it does slow down the rebels a lot. Though I hate that it does that. That whole... No reward borders. Now we can start recharging our oxygen since we have them locked up in the med bay. Ooh, there's somebody not in our med bay. Let's get him suffocated before he actually does anything. <laughs> Alright guys, go fix the weapons. Uh, 
everybody go home. And now we wait a moment, some more. I want to do the nebulas because it gives me the chance to do as many jumps as possible. Though, it's always a risk of not getting anything and just wasting fuel. Defense drone mark one is good. So I did get a defense drone out of that. Why are we hacking him? Had to pull their pilot to come fix stuff, so that's good. We'll we'll save our hack. It's fine. You can go into the med bay then, while there's no evasion and there's no weapons. Liam needs heals, so once he gets done fixing, we'll send him up to go get healed. And that's that. He's done and dead. Okay. Did get a missile and a drone. Alright, jump. We are low on fuel because of those repetitive jumps in there. Come on, hit the weapons. Thank you. I'll take the one damage rather than the three that's gonna happen if I beat that ion. And now they're done. Okay, so we need to figure out some missile defense and we need to figure out some uh, <coughs> shields. Reactor. Sure. I'm holding off on that distress beacon until I get more fuel. Because they're going to want four fuel. That puts real low on missiles, but yes. Now we can do this. Because they're going to want four fuel. But they're going to want to give me a... Okay. Okay. Oh. He dead. Say love you. Yeah, we'll waste a uh, drone on this. Stop messing with my people. But this way I can hack his mind control every time he pulls it off so I don't have to worry about that anymore. Stop that. And he's dead. It's just a matter of this burst laser going off. Done and done. Do have a bunch of scrap now. And a bunch of fuel. We need more missiles, more drones. I'll save the hack. 
in case he actually had something useful, but he shouldn't. Yeah, no worries. And there he's dead. Oh, I don't have to use the drone part on him. At some point I have to make that decision not to take damage to use the drone part, but the two damage we took there, not worth that one drone part since we have still most of our health and we're running low on drone parts. Cool. Back up on missiles, more fuel. Zoltan controlled and Mantis controlled. Let's go Mantis controlled. Jump. Hmm. Distress beacon. And then we should look at how we're getting out of here. Quickly. Quickly leave. Whatever. Okay, we can go to the store. Teleporter drone control with the defense drone or burst laser mark two again. Hmm, let's do it. More offense. <laughs> Lots of offense. Store. We will fix a couple points. That's it for right now. Doors are 35. We do want our doors soon, since we have the Mantis Sector. So we'll probably do that next. Really should have thought about that drone control. Because missiles. Okay, missiles offline. But, and we should be able to do significant amounts of damage. Put one on the piloting now. Done. And dead. Let's grab our doors. For the inevitable mantis boarding parties. We're gonna ignore that distress beacon because we need to start heading towards the exit. Incoming Mantis borders. You two go dandle him. And people shuffle. No. Fine. Forgot the station changes. Okay. The station changes which uh, position is first. Right? First position is always the station. Second position is top left moving to the round. Moving across the top then down from left to right. Alright guys, go home. So like this room, it's one, two, three, four. Whereas this room, it's one, two, three, four. This room, it's one, two, three, four. <coughs> because that station where the people will work is always the first position. That's a lot of weapons. That's a lot of weapons. Nice. 
nice miss. Alright, this volley should finish off his weapons. Well, at least make us immune to them. So we can pull off one to go off on their shields. Enemy FTL is charging, enemy FTL is delayed. Now two can go on there piloting this round since all of the weapons are offline. Three fuel, five missiles, 15 scrap. Tempting, not good enough. Three fuel, one drone part, 23 scrap. Since I've pretty much stopped using missiles, I'll take that. Because the drone parts are still going to be useful for later with the hack. Alright, go home. Jump. Let's go up here. While they walk back to their stations. Cool, free stuffs. I like free stuffs. Over there, there. We may do this triangle, then head up to the exit. Okay, one and two on their weapons. They should probably on their weapons. I do want to upgrade my shields. Uh huh. Okay, cool. I also want to upgrade my evasion. Oh, that's on fire, so good. Go after the piloting instead, which makes means we'll have a much better chance killing them. Will got skilled up. All right, let's do that number for right now, so that we have more shields here, and then we'll do the stress beacon, and then we'll probably head towards the exit. Uh, ooh, okay. We are not having that go off. That is not happening. Yeah, that's not good. That he bombed my weapons and I put one on there. I should put one on weapons. Good miss. That was a seriously lucky miss. Get that missile in there. My piloting didn't. Oh, that's terrible. <sighs> Looks like I was going to get overrun one way or the other, but... Attack the ship. Take their weapons out. The sheer prevalence of missiles apparently is my bane. Good. Good. Pretty sure all of our scrap's gonna go into m engines because we're gonna have to flee from rebels. Like, serious rebels. So. Do that number. Jump in. We have 100% oxygen right now, so we're going to dump our oxygen. Fire everything at their weapons. Charge our FTL and GTFO as fast as possible. That ASP is... Uh, that's fine, nothing important was hit. Come on. 
not important. Good evasion. We out. Next sector. NG Homeworlds. Okay. <clears throat> now we're in trouble. Oxygen up. And we're in a nebula? No, our sensors are just broken. Okay. You two, fix the sensors. There is an oxygen deprivation in there. Go fix this. You two get in here and help. Close these doors, leave that one done. Let the oxygen fight that so that as soon as the hole is breached or fixed, we can fix that. Okay. Then we turn the med bay on. Get everybody healed, then send them all in here to fix this. And hope that we're not dead in the next episode. Because I think that's where that's where my timer says I should leave it. Alright. Well, that was a very interesting first couple of run, or first couple of sectors. Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you next time.